Today, we're playing as the Commonwealth of New Maryland. I'm going to play as Rumera eventually. I'm just going to actually, you know, play a few test games and get a feel for it first. With New Maryland, I don't really have to do that, so I can just jump right into it. Okay, 400 years ago, huh, the first pony trader is led by <laughs> Coltilumbus. Coltilumbus. I, I see, I see, I see what it is, okay. We settled on the coast, okay. Okay, so we start in a decently weak position, you could say. 12 total factories. Wing Barty has about 25 ish, tw 25 to 30 total factories, and they'll get really strong. So we have a ways to go. We kind of have a co political branch over here, and we'll probably be going down the furthest right, ironically placed, I guess, path. First, we need to go over here and get some civilian factories and kind of boost our economy, remove the national spirit, the Great Depression, which is, yeah, not doing us any good. Okay, and since we do have 150 political power, and the obvious choice right here would be to change the economy law, but we can only go to early... Oh, I guess we can't even go to early mobilization. I, I, th I kind of thought we could, never mind. How embarrassing. Well, I'm just gonna get the... Oh, the well-known work pony. That's good, plus 15 st Well, stability is already pretty high, and it'll just get higher. So it might be better to just get... Oh, we'll just get the regular one then, because stability isn't gonna be a problem for us. We're gonna be fine there, maybe. Maybe when we start doing some of these focuses, we'll wish we had more stability, but um, right now we're fine. Okay, we've got a few factories, we've built up our industry a little bit, and I think it's time we finally go towards patriotism, because who wants to be part of Equestria right now? Maybe in a future series I'll play as New Maryland and try to protect Equestria, but for now... We have our own plans, our own worries to deal with. Oh. Kingfishers share our wealth program. The former governor of Celestia, Kingfisher, outlined his share our wealth program in a speech on the radio today. He stressed that no one pony should hold an extreme amount of wealth. Okay, I see where this is going. Oh, that changes popularity and unaligned. I thought that would go a different way, but okay. Yes, New Maryland seeks patriation. An emergency session of New Maryland's Commonwealth Congress came to a close this morning with a vote of 150 to 76 in favor of seeking immediate separation of government. Okay, this follows the collapse in negotiations between Equestria and New Maryland on the subject of New Maryland's sovereignty and the poor economic situation that ravages the nation. The vote has been applauded by many as the first true step on the path of independence. The Governor General may and many in the ruling UEP have remained mute on the matter. We shall seek our own path, and we will seek a very interesting path indeed. And New Maryland recognizes Stalingrad, yes indeed. In complete disregard on the will of the equestrian government, New Maryland has formally announced that it will fully recognize St Stalingrad as its own independent state. Diplomatic relations between the two countries shall be officially established in the upcoming weeks, with a site for the new Stalingrad Embassy having already been selected in Sunset. The Equestrian Ambassador has issued an official protest and has demanded the new Maryland government retracts the announcement, even going as far as threatening to relinquish the Governor General from his office. Okay. Okay, I accidentally hit a button and closed this last time, so I kind of just restarted, did everything exactly the same, got back here, so let's go. First Socialist Conference. The Great Depression and the push for independence have awakened a leftist sentiment in the people of New Maryland. It is in these favorable times that the Communist Party of New Maryland hold its first conference. The Ponies and Griffins meet, not in a fancy conference hall, but in an abandoned harbor warehouse to show solidarity with the plight of the working class. As the conference progresses, three factions has, have formed, each with their own agenda. Lifty Star leads the traditional wing of the party, advocating a form of communism not unlike the one Stalingrad has been practicing. The Equalist faction under Blueberry Frost has more extreme ideas about equality, arguing for a society without money and class. The third faction has drafted their own character called Maryland Socialism, or 
Mayor Scott for short. Shocked gasps and protests are heard as these ponies explain their ideas for a truly stable society. Capitalism, they argue, can be defeated by removing the entire system and rebuilding from the ground up. Okay, so I think this time I'm going to go with what some of you guys recommended. Mare sock? <laughs> let's see what... Let's see what this does. It looks like it gives us, so, 5% communism boost. I think they all do that, yeah. And then we get... A minus 75% improved relations, minus 50% same de ideology reputation, and a minus 75% trade deal opinion factor. So we're pretty much on our own here. But yep. So, Communist Party, Marisok. Let's see what exactly that entails. I'm sure. I see it goes like this. I don't know. I don't think this has anything to do with choosing Marisok. I think. This is still kind of our own thing. Um, purges among the left? Well, the communists and equalists are our allies against capitalism. They lack vision and give in to capitalist ideals such as voting, quality, and free choice. But they do not undertake that this will merely give room for the old order to manifest itself again. So these concepts must be eliminated from consciousness? It, while it may be unsavory, if the capitalist press gets word of it, we must take action against such counter-revolutionary ideas. We will make key figures of other factions disappear and convince others to join us. It's too late for them to stop us now. The end of history awaits. Oh, sick and nothing's wrong here at all. Okay, they'll prepare a coup. Fun stuff. Okay, the Red March. Factory workers, the unemployed, and the homeless took to the streets of Sunset today, demanding the government bring an end to our economic woes. Thousands of ponies marched up Commonwealth Avenue to the Commonwealth Congress, only to stop peacefully in front of the police line. Several ponies were reported to have given flowers to the police officers as they sang communist folk songs and chanted for change. Oh, oh well. Okay. Okay, so there's this song spreading around. And we can kind of decide what to do with it. We shall embrace it, get some stability. We build a better tomorrow for everybody, change in popularity for non-aligned, or communism is the only answer. And with, I think, the path we're going, I think our choice about this waltzing melutil something is, yeah, that one. And the coup. We have readied our militias and secured the, the loyalty of many officials, reporters, and police officers. We have eliminated those who caught wind of our exploits, who might have understood a glimpse of what we were truly planning. The time is ready to seize the future. It's time for Mayor Scott to rise. We will bring a new order to the chaos, so that no pony will, will ever think wrong thoughts again. Okay. Easy enough. Merlindia, oh, Marisok. Sounds very familiar. It sounds like some sort of book or something that, you know, was, was around. Oh, and it's an entirely new focus tree. Oh, okay. Yeah, I didn't real I didn't get the reference until I saw the icon, but yes, that makes sense now. I've never actually read 1984, I believe. Yeah, I haven't actually read it. I've I've heard about it and I've know some some things about it like <laughs> big brother big sister is watching you this time though that's cool maybe i should read maybe i should read the book <laughs> and then get back to the playthrough i don't know i'm a fast reader i could get it i could get it read then i could probably better understand the references okay communist sees power so we're entrenching the revolution that's good Oh, wait a second, that's not good. That's really bad. Okay. This is really good. Oh, the Great Purge. No! Not the Great Purge. Uh, what a counter-revolution. Oh, well. Those who oppose us rise up against us, lose stability. Oh. Shoot. That's that's a lot of people that are against us. I guess we get a big free army, so let's move that down. I didn't expect this. I didn't expect a civil war. So the Commonwealth has returned. Civil war in New Maryland. Okay, let's let's move in. Let's move in. We're not going to let this stand for long.
Yeah, this is a weird civil war that popped up. I don't know, is this- will this always happen? It all- it seems pretty, like, difficult to win. I would think that if there was a civil war, it'd be kind of an easy one. I'm not sure if this is supposed to happen. I don't know. What? New Manhattan explosion? A huge explosion in the New Manhattan Harbor, Harbor shook the city? It's- Blast could be heard by ponies all the way in Sunset. The New Manhattan Police Department reports that the explosion was an accident. Okay. Terrible tragedy. It's not like we need that right now. We're, we have a lot of problems here. And that is not one of them that we can be worried about. Oh, wow. That was, that was quite a civil war. I don't know. Was there something I could do to stop that? Or do they just not like this entire Mayor Scott thing? Oh no. Oh no, we wasted a lot of time against Wing Barty and we lose all those troops that we had. Uh, this is bad. Oh. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. If you have any advice on how this is supposed to work, you can leave it in the comments or maybe I can just I can just play again and be ready for a civil war, maybe? I don't know. Uh, that was a surprise. Anyway, remember to like and subscribe. Tune in next time as we continue playing or we do something differently. We're, we're playing as... We're playing as Mayor Scott, New Maryland. Either way, so... Something will happen. I'll figure something out. out. We may just try to remedy this save somehow and defend against wing Barty. I don't know. Anyway, see you guys then.